we the people of the United States, in order to form a more perfect union, establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility, provide for the common defense, promote the general welfare, and secure the blessings of liberty to ourselves and our posterity, to ordain and establish this Constitution for the United States of America. States are indebted to a central authority. It increases the power of the central government. You have it exactly. The greater the government's responsibility, the greater its authority. Mm. The moneyed interest in this country is all in the north, so the wealth and power would inevitably be concentrated there in the federal government, to the expense of the south. If that is the case, it is unavoidable if the Union is to be preserved. I fear our revolution will have been in vain if a Virginia farmer is to be held in hock to a New York stock jobber, who in turn is in hock to a London banker. The opportunities for uh, avarice and corruption would certainly prove irresistible. Well, there you have it, as I have heard said men were angels, then no government would be necessary. <laughs> well, sadly, that is very well said. Uh, but there can be no question, our nation cannot bind together without powerful central government. But we must also accommodate the needs of our constituent states, both North and South. <laughs>